Hey, welcome to Tom's Take on a Throwback Thursday. I'm throwing back to the Channel 6 Country House. The old WJIM TV for you old people here in Lansing like me. Now it's WLNS Channel 6, the Country House. Still the name. When Harold Gross built this, when he started in 1953, I think it was built as a backup plan in case the TV station concept didn't work out. They, they were going to convert it to a hotel. That's why they had the swimming pool back in here, uh, which I guess was must have been some hell of a employee parties going on here. But I want to talk about the oldies, but recently WLNS, terrific station. I watch it. I also watch the other station on occasion as well. Channel 6 has great staff people, great sales people. I see out there Sea Dog Chad Muntz uh, was in sales, is in sales. My cousin, Dan Batchelor, was a sales manager here for a number of years, and uh, the on-air talent, Audrey Dahlgren, Jerry Jones, and others, uh, you do a terrific job. Big fan of uh, Channel 6. But I want to go back to the old days when it was WJIM. I lived in this neighborhood over here on Kipling Boulevard that I talk about just a few blocks away. In the neighborhood, Mr. Raymond, was he was in sales here with WGIM. Um, Dave McTow was the anchor man here, lived a couple blocks away. This place was near and dear to me because of an afternoon TV show called Alley Cat and the Mayor. Do you remember that one? I attended it a couple times. Howard Lancor, the old anchor, was the, he was the late Howard Lancor. He was the mayor and then Alley Cat and Pansy. And you'd go here, it was an, I think it was like four o'clock and you'd get a try to win a slow poke sucker which is a big chocolate sucker do you remember <laughs> do you remember that but what I like about when I, my memories of this place almost go more to radio as well WJIM AM radio I had a six transistor radio I upgraded to a 10 because I want to hear the Tigers at night when I went to sleep Ray Lane and Ernie Harwell I had this you know so six transistor 10 transistor radios and I listen in the morning to Jack Robbins. Robbins in your radio. This is before FN had really kicked in. And so you want to hear, you know, cool music, young people music. WJIM AM was, it was broad, broadcast right here. They moved over to Pine Tree in recent years, but all here at the country house. One more thing about the country house. Who remembers the Martha Dixon, Dixon show, Copper Kettle? Who? Do 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 Again, have a terrific throwback Thursday, and we'll talk to you tomorrow for another Tom's Day.